All right, we're back. Let's see what we got here real quick. Uh, officer's deck. We got to get to the deck. All right, let's see if there's anything else down here. Where's the squad at? Character is about Kill to make a take use test skill in the dialogue. I think we got this. Yes, sir. Let's go. All right, let's check. And make sure we With don't. With each step, I forge my destiny among the stars. Let's go get the rest of these goods. That's the one thing you can miss. Oh, cargo. All right, we got a bunch of cargo. Cause I think um, there's some systems where you have to like trade. I'm not sure exactly, but I'm thinking that's what we got to do. We are rogue traders, you know. So silent. Let's just make sure there's nothing else that we missed. Tab it up. Goods and stuff over here. shall reclaim what is rightfully ours i think that's everything we got the door open let's go crystals Servo skull, anti gravity impeller, 15% me mechanist, creations cargo, okay, this cargo. As long as we get the cargo, we got. It says it can be equipped. We need those. Accessories. Let's go inventory. What do these do? Operator's gloves, the wearer gains three plus bonus to tech use. Do we care about that? Explosive device suitable for eliminating flimsy obstacles. But who can? Can she take that? I will not. All right, let's get out of here. Let the faith guide my path to glory. Did I mention that my whispers tell me jokes? Jokes that once said aloud make your eyes bleed and blood. I better myself through myself. This ocular implant was oh, a worthwhile implant. Sword level up, got it. Ranks available one, let's see. Let's get it. Um, endure, until the warrior's next turn, all incoming damage is reduced by the bonus. Or we can go here and go to, what is this? Can we use that? Daring Breach? Can we use this? Or do we have to go around clock boss? I'm gonna try and see what happens. Warrior. All right, 
Okay, so we went with that. They got basically the same thing. What she got? Exposed weakness, perfect. Revel and slaughter the soldier immediately removes the winded effect. Until the end of combat, the soldier gains the following bonuses plus 10 ballistic skill. Okay. All right. It feels like I'm missing somebody. Sometimes you consult oh. the appropriate treaties on Tactica Imperialis and weigh every step. Sometimes, though, you just fire your biggest cannon and no, save the day. Duty. I am at your service. If such is the Emperor's will. Where's these goods at? Saying goods, right? Give me the dang on goods, bro. I need all of that. Whatever you wish. flames rings in your ears and the choky smoke makes you cough and gasp for air you instinctively recoil from the scorching heat wiping your face a moment later a hazy silhouette forms in the raging wall of fire you're surrounded by ear splitting noise and screaming yet you distinctly hear the sound of footsteps and then you see the figure out of the fire towards you it's theodore von valencius are you serious Her expression is calm, terrifying so for someone whose body is engulfed in an inferno. One of her hands is resting on the hilt of her power sword. The other is raised in an invite, uh, inviting gesture. Are you lost, my heir? Argenta goes as still as the statue, then slowly raises her weapon. An apparition, a sorceress apparition, trickery of the warp. Sister, you were lower your weapon despite, despite his commanding tone, Albeard does not sound too confident. He is staring at the rogue trader, and you notice a muscle in his cheek twitching, threatening the Lord Captain is outrageous. This is impossible. I doubt you are aware of the limits of what is possible, Deacon. For your worldwide, I mean, your world view is but an iota of what a rogue trader knows and sees. But I can tell that you would like me to share the knowledge with you, that power over reality. Uh, maybe. She watches you without blinking. Her snake-like gaze almost makes you forget about the fire searing, leaving burns in your skin. I can lead you out of these flames, show you a path, rid you of pain, and give you a weapon so that you may defeat your enemies. <clears throat> um, no. We could if we want to go. If y'all want to go, um, if y'all want me to go to the dark side, I mean, I can do that. I usually don't do that. I usually don't do this. Nah, we just gonna go with it, man. Let's see. Your mouth begins to salivate. Each word Theodora speaks is like music to your ears. The entity that now dwells in the deepest recesses of your mind is pleading, begging, demanding that you give her an immediate answer, and that answer can be nothing other than acceptance. What? Don't listen to this abomination. If you, if there is a knot, but his light in your heart you are resolute in your faith and step into the flames the emperor protects his faith will not be deterred by either darkness nor deceitful promises okay we do got on the guard man i mean we could go anakin skywalker but guess not we just gonna go ahead and, and call it what it is
to the void with you. We need to follow Lady Theodora before we suffocate in this furnace. Continue. The people. Albier looks back at the coffin and confused people around him. Deacon, the survivors from the middle decks. We must help the crew lead them out, find a way around. All right. It says conviction. Sometimes your character will have to make tough decisions based on their values, interests, and goals. Such decisions affect their convictions. This can develop into three directions. Dogmatic, iron class, her heretical. Each includes five ranks. The higher rank, the more zealousy the character follows their convictions and the more uh, noticeable the world around them reacts to their actions and decisions. Promotions through the ranks of each of the three directions opens up access to new dialogue lines, events, unique abilities, and also changes the attitude toward others towards you. Okay, so we can go. Walk through the fire, the emperor will guide the righteous. Accept the offer. Take my pain away. Get the people off the bridge. I will leave my people in there. I will not leave my people. Nah, we gonna go with the dogmatic. Let's do this. I've never done this before. Let's do it. We are gonna trust in the emperor and we're walking through the flames. You take a step forward and the illusion breaks. A wave of excruciating pain crashes over you and Theodora's voice fades in the firestorm. You hear the voices of your companions calling you from behind and the screams of the weak dying in the inescapable blaze. Bro, I'm not here for them. They didn't have the faith. The binding inferno, the harrowing pyre, and all consuming storm releases you as you step out, barely able to stay on your feet. The blood is pounding in your ears, drowning out the world around you. Your eyes caked in soot and burnt eyelashes refuse to open free form, uh, from the flames. You take two more steps before collapsing to your knees. The rush of blood in your temples and the horrible pain all over your body clouds your mom before suddenly retreating as if driven away by some mighty will. A new strength spreads through your veins and despite the wounds your body is once more ready for the trials and struggle. You open your eyes and see a glow with warm light. You, the Aquila, the two-headed eagle sigil that signifies the Imperium and the sacred symbol of the Imperium. In the next moment you are struck with an, another realization, a repulsive presence the one that has plagued your mind since my man wounded us is gone. The fire seems to have burnt the entity away without a trace. So we've been cleansed Master, in the fire. Can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, you're alive. Which is more than I was expecting after what you just did. Praise the Emperor. We passed through the flames. Oh, how can this be anything but a portent? For so it is said that the Emperor will bless the worthiest and most steadfast in their faith. She's right. Let's go. Here we go. It says behind Archina, you see the Talas. Oh, no. Over in a fit of nausea, the rest of the people who are following you have withered away in the fire that continues to rage mere two steps away from you. The Emperor protects Sensual. Did you see that? The Aquila, it was glowing. We're still alive. Fancy that. Did you see that? There we go. We'll use You're that. You're delirious. Whatever it is you think you are seeing. <clears throat> Did she follow us? What happened? There was no Theodora, witch. There was an illusion, a temptation, a foul taint that tried to lead us astray. But he perceived its true nature. Continue. Is that right, Adepta Sanctimonious? What, we'll just pretend like we didn't see the Lord Captain standing there in the fire? Abelard, you tell her. Whatever it was, it matters no longer. Uh, your conduct is bordering on madness, or holiness. A path opened behind you, where one moment there was fire, the next only smoldering embers remain. But what am I saying? My eyes must have deceived me. Too much smoke for my lungs. Truly, 
Would you have received wounds like these if there had been no fire? What do you mean, bro? The wounds are merely a sign of a trial laudably passed. It is something to be proud of, the same as decorations or badges of honor. Rise and stand tall. No element holds power over the righteous. Dismiss the help and stand on your own. I feel fine. That's what I'm gonna say. Even if you were anticipating another wave of pain, it does not come. Your muscles feel strong and your limbs obey without fail. And yet deep inside somewhere next to your heart and stomach, you feel a certain tension akin of that taut string. You are at your limit, be it adrenaline or strength or of your faith, it will not carry you much further. What? Are we not gonna make it now? Deacon, do my eyes deceive me? I can swear that I witnessed you step out of a pillar of fire with the rest following in your wake. I hurried here to join forces with you and the others. It is time to push the heretics back. Indeed it is. Look closely at Etherad. Yeah, we're going to do this. We're definitely going to do this. This is Lower Warp Test succeeded. Etherad does not seem to have changed since you first met, but only at first glance. His face has taken on a strange hue. The skin at the temples appears scaled, and his voice now has an uncanny uh, skeeting quality or a screeching quality. These are not traces of fatigue and stress. The Psyker's body has begun to mutate, a consequence of the contact with the warp. We gained 20 experience. You're not in the best shape. My faith will keep me upright with a weapon in my hand. That is all that matters. Yeah. We're going full. We're, 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 we're believing in the Emperor so much that we don't care anymore. I'm just going to buy. I'm just going to go all the way. Zealot. Just that's what we're going to do. Pray forgive my insistence. I shall not be the one to doubt the faith of he who passed the trial by fire. <laughs> you right, brother. It says I've gathered everyone who has answered the Vox call and was able to hold a weapon. Yet I do not see the Lord Captain or our Arch Militant in our midst. We are still receiving messages in her voice, but she is not responding to direct requests. I last saw Lady Theodora on the observation platform. When did you and she part, part ways? It was at this very elevate. Master Ethelred, the Lord Captain accompanied by the Arch Militant headed to our chambers to retrieve an item of particular import. After that, we all heard from her were Vox broadcast. This is troubling and the timing is inopportune. I am still receiving fragmentary reports from the bridge. Conrad Void to Veer was spotted there and even with scant intelligence on the, his activities, I have reminds, I have reminds me of descriptions of scorch or sorcerer's rituals. If that traitor has resorted to witchcraft, we must stop him at once. I shall go to Theodore's chamber to find her. Let's go. A reasonable approach. Take your escort with you. You may be waylaid. Once you have found the Lord Captain, you must beg her to go to the bridge and lead the counterattack. The rogue trader's appearance is sure to fill the defender's hearts with hope, however frightened or exhausted they may be. Until next week. <laughs> next week. Until next we meet, Deacon. May the Emperors bless your deeds. I shall see you on the field of battle. All right. We out. Let's go see the journal. Let's see. We got to reach the secret lift. All right, team. We didn't walk through fire, man. What is this? Do I have an end? What is this? Fresh injury. My oh, man. Let me help. With you at my side. No Victory more Victory is okay. within our grasp. The generator something. There we go. Gonna go or what are we Let doing? us walk this path to the end. Do they just not want to go with this or what? What's, what's the deal with this? Let's go in here. 
me see what this is. Over there. Is there anything else in here? Got more goods. Yo, we're gonna have so much good stuff to trade. We should deal with this. With each step, I forge my destiny among the stars. Alright, see where are we going? Oh, we gotta get this loot, man. Why didn't we get that? We gotta go to that. We gotta find that door. We shall reclaim what is rightfully ours. Going to her quarters. It's definitely gonna get crazy. All right. I expect the worst in here since we seen her out there as a freaking um spirit uh, like a force ghost she can't be in her in her chambers i don't believe see look at that they didn't did her dirty bro they didn't got her up out of there it says you have found an item that can only be equipped by characters of a certain conviction rank you can open the character menu to see which conviction your character follows. All right, that's what I need to do. All right, let's see. Open the menu. All right, let's go see. So we got, I think, yeah, I'm dogmatic one. What is she? She's a three? Gee, what is this man? He's, oh, okay. Heretical. What is he? He's iron class. See, I'm not, I'm not iron class. I'm running it dogmatic. That's what we doing. So what's the weapon though? Where's the weapon that they're talking about? Machine rights. What weapon are they talking about that I have? That's supposed to be assigned. Um, Are they saying there's going to be a weapon that I'm going to grab or what? Hmm. What weapon are they talking about? Let the faith guide my path to glory. Let's get the goods first. We already know she's toast, so where's it at? We are bound by the blood of Marcus. Helmet of the Devoted requires dogmatic follower. This helmet grants his wear immunity to enemy critical hits for the first three rounds of combat. That's tough. Let's see. But the only thing about it is I really want to wear it. I want to wear it, but I think this is going to mess my man. Let's see. If we give him this instead of is he going to look? What's he going to look like? Nah. Why does beard leave, bro? How does this take his beard off? What is this? 
We had goggles? This is beyond me. I cannot comply. Bro, but what is this though? Why is this? Dirt? I won't suffer this. Okay, she'll wear it then. You calm down, bro. Yeah. She'll wear it. She gets a little bit smarter with that. Um, that works for me because he got the goggles and she got the critical chance blocker. So let us walk this path to the end. Theodore's Rosary. The wearer of this amulet gains a plus 10 bonus to commerce and lore. Okay. Is that? Let's get that. Who's gonna rock that? Where is it at though? Did we not pick it up? This is crazy. Sprawled on the large blood wrenched desk, the arch militant's corpse still clutching the weapon is slumped against one of the, of the bulkheads. Emperor, accept thy faithful souls. No! I, Lord Captain, I didn't hear, didn't hear a thing, not a whisper, not a breath. It was, it was so loud. Why didn't I foresee this? Not sure. Uh, Lord Captain, who would even dare? Almost certainly he loathed the Adora. Unless that rat void fear. Uh, first betrayal. First betrayal. Now the, the murder of the rogue trader. And Mort. Where's Mort at? How could Mort have failed her so terribly? The Arch Militant was born on a death world. He had lightning fast reflexes. Unless he killed him. <laughs> I, I can look at things in my own way. If you find something, something that might bear the imprint of the killer, just give it to me, and I'll try to see what secrets it holds. Let's examine her body. Uh, you lean closer to the body, the cause of death is apparent. What ended the rogue trader's life was an auto pistol shot. An extraordinary accurate one at that. Theodora's face bears an expression of surprise, the last emotion she experienced in life so she was surprised that she got shot it says some uh something in the floor catches your eye a heap of blood spattered parchments and scrolls that must have fallen off the desk as you lean down for a closer look you notice something else small shards of glass scattered on the floor inspect the shards um let's inspect the papers Items received, handwritten letter with a seal. Reports, accounts, dispatches. You go over the scrolls until you stumble upon a document that is starkly different from the rest. It is a handwritten letter signed with the initials XC and a seal with a symbol that is vaguely familiar to you. Lore Imperium, test succeeded and sends a shiver down your spine. The author of this letter, addressed to Theodora, signed it with the seal of one of the holy ordos of the Emperor's Inquisition. The secret po uh, police of the Imperium have relentlessly hunts heretics, Xenos, and other enemies of humanity. All right, let's see. We got to inspect the shards. It is difficult to say what exactly was broken. The object fell on the floor, and that is as much as you can ascertain. Upon closer examination, the shards appear iridescent rather than completely transparent, as if they had been submerged in, what is this, Promethium? Um, combustible fuel, okay. Examine the arch militant's body. Yeah, so somebody that they knew killed them because he was from the death world and she was surprised. 
An auto pistol shot went through Mort's forehead, spraying the floor and the furniture around with blood matter. In shards of the skull, the safety of the arch militant's weapon is off. The killer must have been a split second quicker than he. Let's see. Would you try touching Theodora? What does these shards tell you? Let's ask her that. I see streaks of color, luminescence, blue lights, faces drawing closer. Lady Theodora and Conrad. And what is that? Ah! Something hmm. dark, enormous. Oh, this glass thing was something foul, that's for sure. All right, let's see. Tainted witchcraft. Uh, let's see. I, I guarantee she's not going to do this. Uh, would you try touching Theodora? You might be able to see through the killer's eyes. I don't think she's going to do this. It doesn't work like that. I can try to read the memories of objects, but dead bodies are a different story. Something like that would require her soul. And after what we saw on the officer's deck, I won't risk searching for it in the warp. All right, we best be on our way. Yes, the crucible of battle calls to me once more. No, right. wait, we must see if we can find anything. Okay. Idira, you can't bring her back. Let her go. You'd give up so easily, old man? I expected as much from the sister. It's not like she has a heart. But you? Oh no. I'll get to the bottom of this. I'll find the one responsible for murdering the Lord Captain. And when I do, that scum will regret the day they were born. All right, so we got to get to the bridge, but we got to get the goods out of here first. We're not leaving. Oh, we got a cape. Grants five plus fellowship for each enemy and a two cell radius. What does this fellowship do, though? Collected. Let's go inventory. Who, who can rock the cape, though? So this... You know I gotta put that on. Where does this go? Then the cape. Oh, look how official we look. Except for them goggles, you know. We do got the spectacles on, but other than that, we looking pretty legit. Um, all right, here we go. Tab, is there anything else in here? This does. Let's check this room out. Out of my world, the chaos. Our foes shall be crushed beneath our unyielding might. Oh boy, these boys wanna try to try to come at me, huh? Prepare for battle. Let's move. Can we move you? Put you in some kind of cover, my guy. Oh, Albert, you're too far back, dude. Uh, let's put her right here. Idra. I'm gonna let you try to go first. Can you go first? Okay. We're ready. Complete. Move him there. All right, let's see. I'm not interested. Let's do. Let's go over here. We gotta swap out for this one, so I can go ahead and get the shot off. Your corrupt way has failed you. 
I will not be deterred. And so it shall be done. Bro, he missed. You will encounter enemies with various abilities and features. An icon next to an enemy's portrait indicates that they are under the influence of some kind of effect. Right mouse button on the effect icon to see more details. Who has something beside him? Cut, okay. Let's see, she can move up here. Then. Faith without deeds is worthless. Doubt is for the weak. Oh. Escape the Emperor's judgment. That's good shots. Do that again. Damn. As the Emperor commands, I act. Nice. Okay. Let's move you here. Cause she's gonna be good with this. What is this foreboding? <gasps> was was that you? Anything else? Oh, that was fit. perfect. <laughs> yeah, that was nice. No can do. Uh, can we put it on you? We'll do. All right. Got it. This is in the combat log. Oh, let's take that off. Let's move up here. A tactically sound approach. Now we can get that charge. I will do my duty. Oh, slice him up. It will be done. Thank you. allow myself to do this actions will speak louder than words okay she can get up here and Hit him with this, right? On it. Ah! I'm not so sure. Expose this. We, we can't do it on him? Alright, well, let's do this. Not this guy's job. We'll do. Okay. Boom. Oh man, he walked through two of them. Pain and duty go hand in hand. You have to be kidding me on that. Bro. He just tried to change all my Victory man. is imminent. Done. 
I'll do it. Ouch! What the hell? As the Emperor commands, I act. <laughs> I will bathe this battlefield in righteous fury. Bro, she about to clap everybody. Faith without deeds is worthless. They who discern the future hold the battlefield. All right. Look no further. Who has the? The emperor sets my path. Oh, this everybody drop, leveled up too. Greater trials lie ahead. All right. Thank you. Let's level them up. Then we'll get ready to go ahead and call this episode. What is this? Choose talent or. What's this? The warrior immediately restores all AP and gains an eight an agility bonus until the end of the turn. Oh, we get to pick something. <clears throat> what is this? Whenever the warrior is attacked, they gain plus one stack of epicenter of slaughter until the end of combat. At the start of their turn, the warrior gains plus temporary wound. He gets a plus temporary wound for each stack. These temporary wounds cannot exceed the warrior's bonus. What does that do, though? All right, so we'll just I think we should do I think we should go with that. Because what is this enrage if the warrior has less than no. I'm gonna go with this. I don't know what it is, but we're gonna rock with it. Complete. Whenever an enemy attacks the warrior, the warrior's next melee attack against that enemy deals an additional bonus. Desolation. The warrior deals an additional thick skin. The warrior gains plus one damage deflection. Uh, their parry chance is increased. Let's do that. And then let's see. Dismantling attack. Tide of excellence. Whenever the operative triggers an exploit on the enemy, the operative gains plus one damage. Okay. Let's do that. And then complete. And then what can she do? Fired up. Whenever the soldier deals damage, their critical damage is increased. Yeah. I like that. Cover efficiency is increased by plus 10% for full cover and plus 20 for half cover. Um, that'd give her some better defense. But whenever a soldier deals damage, I like that. I wanted to drop some damage on him, bro. That's, that's good. So we got everybody leveled up. We just got that and let's get all this. The divine watches over us. Okay. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna go ahead and call it an episode because this one's getting a little bit long. Uh once we get back, what do we have to do? We have to do we have to reach the voice ship bridge, so that will be on the next episode. If you guys did like this content, please hit the like, hit the subscribe, share the video. And if I've made any, um, if there's some other choices that I could have made uh, for my characters, let me know something down in the chat. Um, I greatly appreciate it. I'll catch you guys on the next one.